His opponent, about to make his way to the ring, he hails from the other side of darkness, weighing 256 pounds, former WWE superstar, Gangrel! You know, we had Papa Shango at Double Jeopardy, and now we, we come back with Gangrel? Maybe the only person creepier than Papa Shango. Yeah. This is gonna. This is a man that I think got robbed of the WWE European Championship when he took on Sean Waltman at the Royal Rumble in '99. He's had some great match, ma great matches with Edge. God, just a who's who of professional wrestling. You name him, Gangrel has been in the ring with them. This man's been wrestling longer than I've been alive. He's seen he has seen the road many a time. A true journeyman of our business. And still one of the, the busiest independent wrestlers on the scene today. And once, mar and once married to the late great Luna Vashan. Yeah, who he, we, who he, once, he once told me about eight years ago that I reminded him of Luna in, in ring. Ooh. And it was truly one of the greatest compliments I've ever received in my life. I, I, after you get a compliment like that, yeah. And yeah, you're, you're talking about it earlier. Yeah, he's got a really bad limp, but again, it's that busy training schedule. It's oh, that yeah. Training and, schedule and the, and the travel. Wrestling is his life, and, you know, he, he trains in class every Monday uh, for CCW out in Florida. Like, he is busy. An international traveler regularly. The miles that this man has seen, it wears your body down. Oh, and you, just, you just remember, I just look at Gangrel, and I just remember the massacre that he laid upon Miles Mora, who we will be seeing him again coming, coming up this summer. Yeah. It's gonna be a bloodbath. There we go. Two men that will not, that will go, they'll stand toe to toe with you. There ain't gonna be no bagging down in this one. I don't, I see this one. You ain't gonna see amateur wrestling in this one. I think no. you're gonna see, I think you're gonna see a couple, I think you're gonna see both hands up. Uh, this is gonna be a fight for the ages. Yep. Uh, and the other, here's the other thing when it comes to, Gangrel, if you remember, he was part of the very first TNA pay-per-view. Jeez Louise, you're right. I mean, yeah, it's still known as, known as the Vampire Warrior, but when you're gonna be aligned with the Disciples of the New Church, <laughs> with honestly the man that he should have had multiple world titles in Malice. <laughs> Gangrel getting him sucked up here. Yeah. It, it, does it seem like X is just not impressed with the crowd right now and the look of Gangrel right now? You know, it doesn't necessarily surprise me. This guy marches to the beat of his own drum. He doesn't care what the fans think whatsoever. But he should. He should be careful. <laughs> Everybody trying to... Gangrel and Jen, Jenna Pride doing a handshake, but X kind of finds that a little, he found that a little biased. And if Jesse Ventura right, would be here right now, I'm sure he would be lambasting about that. I mean, you're about to have a great match with him, X. At least you can do is show some respect to your yeah. past. Not for, for guys like Gangrel, Edge and Christian for that matter, with the Brood, we wouldn't have great wrestling right now. And there would be no X, I can guarantee you that. No. Gangrel very much a pioneer yeah. of the weird and the freaky. Here we go, the lock up and we are underway. 
Stalemate here. I, I listen to this, and I the first person I think of when it comes to this is Van Hammer. <laughs> It reminds me of like working fair shows or, or carnival or uh, camp shows. That's that always seemed to be the go to. And I know Gangrel's worked a lot of camp shows whoa, up whoa. in England. That's disgusting. I think that's that could be the trigger for Gangrel. <laughs> I like Jane Pride's face right now. Oh, this is going to get ugly. I, I don't like this one. This, again, these are those mind games that Gang Grell likes to play. And look at this. See, it's getting X all fired up here. Here we go. Oh, X with a knee to the cut of Gang Grell. Oh. There it is, those that big brick that's called his hand, his fist. <laughs> yeah, you don't say. Yep. Oh. Here comes Gangrel. Taste of X's medicine. Big shot there by Gangrel. Whoa! A little pep in that one. Oh! Lighting up the chest of X. Here we go. Up in the ropes. Oh, no. Gangrel sternum first into the top turnbuckle. Yeah, you got reversed there at the very last second. Oh, big chop, and that drops Gangrel. Oh, no, I want the crowd to be quiet on this. Yeah, not as much pep as it usually is. <laughs> that that job did nothing but anger Gangrel. How do you beat a vampire, man? I ask that seriously. Uh, I mean, hey, Gangrel has fallen before, but. This could be a, this is probably one of the better tests with the Monster X. We got going here and big body slam delivered by the Vampire Warrior Gangrel. Off the ropes. Nice elbow drop. And still dropping with the best of them. Here's a cover. Two. Oh, listen to the crowd. Giving their, they're giving their respect to Gangrel. And if there's anything that everybody likes doing with Gangrel, it's learn, is sitting under his, I, I want to say learning tree, but right. say, oh my, he's biting him. He just bit the fingers of Gangrel, and a lariat sends down Gangrel. Here's a cover. This is huge for X. Only a two count. Not favoring the fingers there, and here comes X. Just gonna maul on him. Whoa! <laughs> Jane of Pride. Yeah, don't mess with her. <laughs> don't mess with her, man. I mean, we <laughs> we always talk about we get we always talk about Aubrey Edwards, but yeah, let's let's not discount let's not count on Miss Pride here. Yeah, she's jacked. Man. Thrown in the corner, Van Grell, and yeah, this is this is typical playbook, modus operandi of X. Yeah, ride those counts out as long as you can. So you only have so many chances against a veteran like Gangrel. In the buckle. Oh, <laughs> that was just a clubbing chop right there. Pig. The elbow caught the jaw of that one. I was gonna say a big forearm, but the elbow caught the jaw. X in. Oh, man! Huge 
huge knee delivered by it. Totally Axe. squashed him in the corner. Gangrel's on Dream Street right now. Oh, what it. Oh, we've seen this many a times. No! Oh! Thrown across the bottom rope. And here's the scary part. If X gets going, then you get to see his suplex extraordinaire come out. And you have often compared X to Buddy Lee Parker. Gabriel still alive. And basic chin lock now, it's Gangrel having to carry his own weight and X's weight. Yeah, he's got a strip tight there. Crowd really getting into it here in Lower Mania. Man, look at the fuck. Oh, wait a minute. Look oh at the forehead. We got a cut. Of, that elbow might have cut Gangrel. Here we go, Gangrel starting to fight back. There's so oh. much blood in Gangrel's life, man. This is wild. Ah, oh, this was a mistake I shouldn't have made. Off the ropes. No nope, reversal. Big back elbow, and it caught the chin of Gangrel. Yeah, it got him right in the forehead, right in the middle. And when you've been cut open hundreds of times the way that Gangrel has, your skin up there is extra sensitive, and it's that much easier to get cut. Yep. I just think whenever I see those stuff like that, it, it just reminds me of how Vanderlei Silva's head was cut open all those many a times and they had to clean off so much scar tissue off of him. For sure. I know people get on me about bringing up mixed martial artists, but they go, in pro wrestling, you go through almost the same thing. Gang ground now starting to fight back here. And here it is! Wow. What an exploder suplex. It just shows you how strong X is. Yeah, Gangrel, not a small guy. Look at the eyes. <laughs> if you saw the, if you saw that at home, yeah, look at those eyes. It's... He looks possessed. Yeah. I thought it was a look of shock at first, but oh, X is just, he's just stunning Gangrel right now and stomping away on the warrior, on this warrior. Ah! Measured him for the elbow drop. X was really long into that cover, and if you have a legend prone, you said it. Take advantage. You got that legend prone. Get your get the advantage. Yeah, now he's taking it seriously. Crowd really getting into it here for Grang Gangrel. Just another one of the great matches we've had here in Wilmer Mania. Oh, X is measuring him. I wouldn't be challenging him to get up. Oh, he went for another. He went for another suplex and Gangrel stopped him. Reversal. Ah! Coming on the shoulder. <laughs> and it's Gangrel's turn. Maybe he'll draw some blood. Big Lariat! Here comes Gangrel! Re nope, reversal. Great, re great job there by Gangrel. Get nice. that Russian leg sweep. Floats over. No. He's, looking, he's getting ready to crucify X right now. Here we go, oh, wait a minute, X! He definitely had that scouted. Oh, reversal. Oh, follows him quick with that back elbow. Oh, One-handed bulldog. Beverly Dunn. Into the cover. Here's the count. 
No, it's a shoulder up for X. Barely getting that shoulder up. You can like him or hate him, but X is hanging very tough. Definitely. With Gangrel. Definitely showing his own resilience in this match. Yeah, great, ma great match so far. You got to give X a lot of credit. Standing toe to toe with the legend, but this might be it. Nope. Reversal. Oh, no. Gina Prime just missed it. Oh, oh bad. Bad break for X. Well, that's what happens when you miss <laughs> the referee in the face. What, do you expect her to count? Oh, oh, come on now. Get your hands off of her. How unnecessary. X is berating. Oh, Gina wow. Brown, she just on. fell on the concrete. What is this? That's awful. Come on. Tough guy. God. Wait a minute, now it's it. Now X is gonna measure. Oh, wait a minute! Well, tits of your own medicine! Tit for tat, man. Alex Benson in. King Grill with the Impaler! Gangrel.